Welcome to the Travel in Europe channel. This is a YouTube channel that specializes in travel around Europe with specialty for Italy. We have cities, food and wine, sites that you want to see. Italy has some of the finest wines in the world. There's nothing like a good Barolo or Brunello. And there's nothing like having a glass of red dry wine with a view. Hi, I'm George Fiebisch. And this vlog is on uh, another of my favorite topics. The one before this was gelato. Uh, this is wine, vino. So if you're in Italy, um, there's great wines. Um, you can get bottles of wine, you can get wine in the glass, um, you can get a carafe. The carafes are usually the cheapest because you're not paying for the bottle, the cork, the labels, and it's a local wine. Italy has fantastic world-class wines. Uh, one of my favorite is Brunello. The Brunellos in America are very costly. It's hard to find one for under $50 a bottle. Uh, in Italy, you get them for half that, sometimes cheaper. Um, I usually travel back with a Brunello or two in my suitcase. And no, they don't break. <laughs> you want to know where wines, different wines, different grapes that make those wines come from. So if you're in those areas of Italy, you know what to order. Um, you, know, you don't want to order a wine from the north when you're touring around the south. Get the local wines. They're going to be better, they're going to be fresher, um, and you're going to enjoy it. One of the confusing things uh, some people have is um, Montepulciano. Montepulciano is a town in Tuscany, and it makes a wine by that name from the Sangiovese grape. But there's also a Montepulciana de Bruzzi, which is not in Tuscany. And it's made from the Montepulciano grape. So they're two different wines. I love the Montepulciano de Bruzzi. Um, it's, a, it's a great world-class wine. One of the last types of wine that um, I like, if you're going to Italy for a month or three months, uh, and you want to, you know, you have a place you've rented, you want to have enough wine uh, around so you can have it when you, when you want it. Um, I look for bulk wines, and they're called Vino Sfuso. Um, there are places that have huge kegs uh, of wine, uh, wooden kegs, and the wine is stored in there. They have, um, you know, sweet, dry, red, white, whatever you want. You can come in with anything. You can come in with a glass uh, jar, uh, you know, a pitcher, uh, a, an empty water bottle, plastic water bottle, and they'll fill them up for you. Um, the one I used to go to in Southern Italy was two euros a liter. That's amazing. That's a lot of wine you can drink. <laughs> uh, and it's good wine. It's local wine. They also will give you a taste, because they may have, let's say you like red dry wine. Um, they may have five, six uh, different types, and they'll let you taste them. So, okay, that's the one I like. And then fill a couple uh, water bottles, or if you have a big glass pitcher with a top, fill that up. Um, get a couple liters and bring it back. It's good stuff. All right, so you're going to Italy. You know what cities you're going to. Um, how do you determine what wines to try or get? There's um, a book that I think is uh, fantastic that'll help you understand um, the grapes of Italy, the wines of Italy, the regions, which wines come from which regions, how to even pronounce the wines. And it's Wine Notes by Bob Lipinski and Gary Gruner. This is the book by Gary Gruner and Bob Lipinski on the wines of Italy. This is another book by Bob Lipinski and Gary Gruner called Italian Wine and Cheese. You can find all of Bob Lipinski's works and information at his website here. Here's a typical Italian trattoria set up with wine and water. Here's another place, same thing. 
and yet a third place. You always have your wine, you always have your water. Here, a nice salad to go with it. And of course, what better to go with wine but some pasta? And here I am with a glass of wine and a smile. And yet another glass of wine and smile. A view with through a glass and another glass of wine. You get the idea? There's lots and lots of vino. If you've liked this video, hit the like button below. Also, subscribe to my channel. Once you've subscribed, don't forget to press the bell to get more videos of this type.